Shalom and welcome to the last episode of our series on finding hope in the midst of trials. We've been looking at encouraging truths that Peter brings for us that we can apply even as we go through a crisis or an affliction or a hardship. Today to sum it up, we look at 1 Peter 1 verses 8 and 9. It reads, You love him even though you have never seen him. Though you do not see him, you trust him, and even now you are happy with a glorious inexpressible joy. Your reward for trusting him will be the salvation of your souls. The encouragement that Peter gives us here is that even as we go through trials as we trust God we will be filled with joy that is inexpressible in the here and now right now because of what we have in Christ that our trials and our afflictions are momentary and we look forward and we see right now the joy we have in Christ God wants to remind us that our joy is not just reserved for heaven but it is applicable even for us today. Joy is something that is reserved for today and for all who have been born again into a living hope that is in Christ. We see that Christ is in every one of our situations. Peter is highlighting that all we need to know is that Christ is in our here and now. He is right here with us in our situation. And that in itself brings about a happy and a glorious and an inexpressible joy. Peter says three things in the verses 8 to 9. He gives them this inexpressible joy. He says we have this inexpressible joy no matter what the circumstance because of our love for Christ our trust and belief in Christ and because of our joy in Christ our love for Christ because we are experiencing his true character and virtue our trust and belief in him because we are trusting in all that he has promised and our joy in Christ because this joy comes as a result of our loving him and our trusting him so the reward that we have for trusting him no matter what the situation is that we have salvation for our souls so we are to be looking forward because no matter what we are going through the joy that we have in Christ has a reward for us it is the salvation of our souls So as we do this moment by moment even now right now we will be filled with that inexpressible and glorious joy that we have because we are in Christ. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, these encouraging truths have been a blessing to us that despite what our world and we go through today we know that we have our joy in you. because we love you we trust you and we we believe in you thank you for the reward that is there for us which is the salvation of our souls that makes life easier that makes our hardships easier to handle thank you for the hope that we have in you and the inexpressible joy that we have in knowing Jesus Christ our lord and savior in your precious name we pray Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.